I take you on a walk to the market and to the coffee to my favorite coffee shop This is Figueres on a peaceful Saturday morning. Spanish people don't get out so early, as you see. Only German, German expats. Got some palm trees here, surviving even in the winter, in the Spanish winter. Here is the home for elderly people, a foundation. I had a friend I was taking care of, his name was Juan, he was living here. You see, due to COVID, you got all the security measures now. And then you go here. and the market, we're coming to the market. Still delivering things. I'll take you over the market. This is a lady here, He's, um, she's producing stuff with her son and selling it here on the market, this lady here. Hola. Hola. See all these fruits. All fresh fruits from these people as well, they produce it themselves. Take you a little bit around. Got flowers here. Look at all these flowers. If you want to plant your own salads, you can do that here. Yeah. Buy some planted, a salad plant. Yeah. Like meat products. 
cheese from the region and meat products again. Olives, pepperoni. There we go. Sometimes I go to this coffee shop. It's been refurbished. In summer it's very nice looking at the market. And listening to the sound of the market. It's totally refurbished and interiorly. There's my other friend. Bon dia! another friend he's from um, Morocco he's a market seller here now we come to the second market there are two markets there are two market squares in Figueres I like the, the morning because it's more peaceful you know not so many people When I'm coming to these guys, I feel like in in the old city of Jerusalem. Got all the guys from Morocco selling. Hola. Hola. See here, that's my friend from Morocco's place. Hola. Salam alaikum. Asra. Asra. You see. You go all the way around. All COVID pre-occupations, pre as they call it, no measures for security. Oh, I show you where I buy the my honey. It's the best honey place in Figueres. Buy the best flowers. It's my friend. I don't know if my friend is there he's there that's his girlfriend he's selling she's selling flowers a lot of flowers let's have a look at the flowers <laughs> see all these flowers beautiful no yeah here's more to come it's paradise of flowers there she is that's the flowers are bon dia todo bien that's the market this is the best honey seller in Figueras. If you need some good honey from Figueras, this is my friend. Bon dia und feliz dia. Tu eres el mejor productor de miel, he dicho. Merci, ciao. It's more. Bon dia. Here, fresh olives, they're beautiful. No, and look at the nuts, all these nuts, oh dear, and also sweets. You need some sweets. Look at this, all sweets, it's sweet paradise. Look at this again, no? These colors, these mixtures of colors, beautiful, no? Then you go here. You have look COVID, everybody's very organized. And here you have cheese products from the region. And now I take you to my favorite coffee shop. You're going to pass the house where Salvador Dali was born. That's the nice thing about Spain, you have this coffee culture, you know, a lot of, a lot of little coffee shops around every corner and every like person has his favorite coffee he's going to 
And now we are going to the house where Salvador Dali was born. They're renovating the house right now. There it is, just in front of you on the right. By the way, I was living in the left house when I arrived in Figueras 2014 in December, just opposite in one of these apartments on the other side, looking, my room was looking at the house where Salvador Dali was born on the 11th of May, May 1904. Here we are. That's his house of birth. They are reconstructing it and it's going to be <clears throat> a museum as far as I know. You can read a little bit here if you know Catalan. I think it's museization. I never heard this word before until yesterday. There's Salvador Dali's father and Figueres 1900s. Huh? Father and mother. She died when he was very young, around when he was 20. Here we go. Another favorite coffee shop of mine, which is called Maya. I'm going to pass Maya. Two friends here. Don't want to be filmed. I think these guys, they don't want to be filmed. Oh, he doesn't like to be filmed. So, Cafe Maya, one of my favorite ones. But I don't take you to Cafe Maya today. I want to show you some more beautiful architecture here in Figueras. Look at this architecture over here. And here as well. Old style Figueras, huh? This one? You see? This one. Now I'm going to show you where I lived when I arrived in Figueres. It was in this street here. This looks like a restaurant out of an Edward Hopper painting. If you look inside, it's not open yet. Calle Montureuil, that's where I lived when I came. Often went to this coffee shop down here. Here again, the house of Dali from the other side. There is young Dali. Young Dali. And I was living here on the third floor, the second window. That's where I was living. That was my room when I came here. Now we are going to the Rambla, so Figueras, and we are coming closer to my coffee shop. Look here, typical tapas. 
Tapas Bars and Drinks, Dynamic, it's a friend of ours, who owns the shop. Good food in there. Here you got the Museum of Alt Emporta. That's the region, it's called Alt Emporta here, northern Catalonia. A lot of artists and painters here. And coming to the Ramblas. That's the Ramblas of Figueras. Ramblas is the main square of every Spanish town. It's called Ramblas. You see Spanish people, they do a lot of sports, like the bi biking. And then you got here, La Cis Montirol, one of the famous um, children of Figueras. And there is another one, maybe I'll take you back. Yes, I will take you back one more time before going to the Ramblas because I show you something more. That's a pity that was a very nice coffee shop. It closed due to COVID, to the shutdown, lockdown. Because I want to show you here closely. That's the museum, no? Alt Emporta Museum. And I want to show you something else because I was living in a famous street. The famous people lived and were born in this street. Like Salvador Dali, I told you, Calle Montirol. You also have him, the inventor of the submarine, Charles Fagues de Clement, something like that is my German accent. And we got a teddy bear over there. Because there's also a museum of toys of Catalonia. There are original toys from Dali in that museum as well. I will take you there. Look, they're all small streets. That's the nice thing about Figueres, you have like the Ramblas. Take you on the Ramblas this time. Spanish people like also lottery, a lot of them playing them. Now we go to the Ramblas of Figueres. There's a f um, a little river under this Ramblas, it's amazing. One time one of these trees fell down and there was a big hole and we could see the river which is under the Ramblas. Look, people are relaxing in summertime, especially at night at 11, 12 o'clock. It's full when it's hot and it's cooling down. Everybody's here. It's, I imagine paradise like this. You, you sit under the trees and, and you enjoy the coolness of the summer evening. But now you see it's winter time. I take you some more. Because over here, before we get to the coffee shop, I take you, tell, take you to the theater of Figueras. Look here again, the architecture. It's not beautiful. Here you can see how the houses were built in the ancient times. You see that? This wood, huh? There we go.
Let's go to the theater now, Figueres. Look, the sculpture. And now you're going to see the theater of Figueres. Here it is. Beautiful, no? show you something else this watch over there you see this watch and the architecture again no beautiful now we are coming to the museum of toys of Catalonia and then finally to the coffee shop here you can see the way of Dali they made special for tourists, like where you can walk in the footsteps of Dali. This is the sign for it. You hear the bus, that's Mediterranean birds in the morning. Here is the museum for the toys up here. You see all these small streets, beautiful now. Still closed. Small streets up there is the museum of Salvador Dali. It's up there. Look at the architecture here. Again, small streets, lovely small streets you got. This is the town hall square. Nice coffee shop where I sometimes go as well. Cafe Interval. This is normally for the tourists in summer. As you got here, it's like you can get good meat and cheese as well. Another favorite coffee shop of mine where I wrote my book Windsurfing with God. You can find it on on um, Facebook on Amazon. It's Cafe Maya, the second Cafe Maya, that was the owner in there. And up there, we are coming to again to the Museum Dali and the church I go to, San Peter Church. Springtime in Spain, you see.
Isn't that beautiful? Look here. Right there. The doffs, the Mediterranean doffs. The Dali Museum. See the Dali Museum. Over 1.2 million people per year before COVID came, coming here. Here you can see some. That's the speciality here. It's a bread from the region from one of the towns here in Dali, made out of it. I will show you, here's the bread, you see? And then you have the surrealistic art of Dali. Jewelry, he did as well. Famous, the watch of Dali. And you saw it on the street markations where walking in the footsteps of Stali, you did his ants as well. So you all have these little tapas bars closed now in the morning. And look at this Mediterranean architecture and calmness, no? Beautiful. And now I show you the bread. There's the master himself. Dali's signature. He painted his sister. That's in Kadakes, in the summer house of Dali and his family. That's his sister, he painted her. One of the famous pictures. The watch again. And Spanish tourist products. And I wanted to show you the, the bread. How he used it, Dali. He he did all this museum, all the design, everything was done by him personally. He buried in the museum. Look and even this detail here. Here is the bread, the famous bread you saw, and now you got it here on the wall, all over the wall, and the famous X of Dali. See that here. And now time for the coffee shop, no? We walk down here. Normally in summer, in front of the museum, there are big lines, like 500 meters, because everybody wants to go into the museum. But these days, with COVID time, no tourists here. You see Spanish people, they love biking, sports. Oh, that's a nice, interesting hotel I have to show you. Hotel Plaza Inn. Look at this all, isn't that funny? Surrealistic hotel. My friend the clown. Nice guy, by the way, here, room mobile. I fix my mobile phone here. I don't get paid for anything for that, by the way. It's just like I tell you about my life here in Figueres. The guy reparated my phone very well. Look again, look at this, this architecture. Then the small little 
the streets. One of another favorite coffee shop. But uh, now I take you to my favorite, favorite one. First, I have to show you all this architecture again here. You see this beautiful architecture here? for my favorite coffee shop. Two grill, sometimes we go and have a kebab here with my brother on Sundays. There's my favorite coffee shop. And there's the boss of the coffee shop. He's from China. Bon dia! Now I go into my favorite coffee shop. It's in here.